I'm talking out. If they're not stupid, go away. Go. Go. <laughs> And we're going to cook outdoors. Finally, the time has come. I'm going to use the trangia again. And we're going to make, we are kind of ambitious today. Carbonara, but with penne, not spaghetti. It's going to be a twist. Uh, we need to prepare a bit, you know, pack some food, coffee, make coffee in a thermos, in a thermos and take it with us and have some warm clothes. It's not that cold, but we're going to go, you know, to the lake and it's always a bit chilly, but it's like we are on the plus. What is it? Nine Celsius. I don't know what's that in Fahrenheit. I will probably Google it and put it here. So yeah, I'm gonna pack now. So, are we preparing? Yeah. Okay, we're getting ready now to go out. Of course, I'm going out with makeup. Do you think I will go out without makeup, even if it's for the lake, going to the lake? Have we packed enough ration? the boys ah, and that my most important um, accessory is this the coffee and uh, this yes awesome gamer yeah it's been a while since I played something well no it's not a while since I gamed uh, hold that thought we will go through that in a while we have arrived name of this place doesn't matter Nesta Juan okay what would that translate to like uh, next lake next lake we are to the lake that is called next lake yes I'm going to be using those things to cook I will be making the cooking and uh, you we are you are just going to be assisting if needed there it is I'm gonna open it and yes I have all the accessories here Let's see how successful I'm going to be. The boys are going to play with a, a remote control monster truck. So the idea is, the plan is to make a carbonara. By carbonara I mean, you know, the real carbonara with uh, eggs and uh, cheese, not cream. But we have it with us in case things go to hell or sideways or what is the better expression. Uh, so just to save the dish, we have some cream with us. In that case it won't be a real authentic carbonara, but it will be a very nice pasta dish. Let's call it, let's keep it like that. So I have, uh, oh, and it's not going to be spaghetti for the convenience. Uh, we're going to be using, uh, I'm going to be using, and we'll see what happens. So let's call it a very nice uh, pasta dish, carbonara inspired. ask the expert <laughs> how to okay what am I going to do how am I going to put this together with the gas hello no, so no. this is where the water will be boiled yes and how do I put this in action this is an extreme sport I say you do it well for me it's extreme Papa. sports uh, I knew it was upside down yes well, I was, I did that, but the uh, flask. No. Well, stop with the comments. <laughs> now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut here with this. It's not the most convenient, but it is definitely doable if you want to do that. So, Operation Carbonara, outdoors by the lake. So far, so good. Yeah.
water is boiling. Ah, salt! Salt in the water! We need some salt, yes? Salt, done. Good. Yes. So, until the water is boiled, we're gonna have some coffee. Oh yeah, uh, gaming. When it comes to gaming, I haven't been gaming that much. I have actually, I have been gaming. Let me correct that. And I have been meaning of making some comment about it. What I have been playing recently, it's a, a non-graphics uh, game. It's a, it's an RPG, it's a text RPG, Vampire the Masquerade. And you know, it's just a story, it's just text you read and you have options and you go forward. So it, it's amazing. Besides that, I have been talking about it also in my lives. Octagedon. Do you know Octagedon? My son has discovered it. It's so fun. I want to make some videos about it or even live. Like it's so much fun. So I have been playing that. This is the game. It's no, not much World of Warcraft lately. I know with everything going on also with Blizzard. It's not that. It's not because of that. It should be, I guess, but I don't know. Yeah, that's my... Yeah, text-based RPG is my current game. It's getting really fast, this one. So I shouldn't waste time. No, please. You're not helping me here. <laughs> You're opening a lollipop. <laughs> so... <laughs> But it's a challenge because let's say I'm not an experienced carbonara maker. And all not out only tomato, of course I'm making uh, other dishes, delicious dishes. Or outdoors cooking. Oh outdoors cooking zero you experience. To fair, it's about oh I don't Thank you to yeah, I know. I, about I, know. I, know. <laughs> yeah, I have zero outdoors cooking Here's experience. Okay, you're right. I'm sorry, I apologize. Yes, On camera I'm I also. Butter, no. <laughs> Oh no! Uh, you have any uh, please? Thank you. Oh hey Siri! Put the timer for 10 minutes. Yes. 10 minutes and counting. Yes. That's the end. In which language? Saskia. Okay. I think it's called a Sest iron in English, but it Zest, might be Swedish. Sestrian. Yes, now we're using it for that because it's convenient. It is. So it's easier to be up while you're cooking. It's supposed to be quite loose. Yes, we have the cream as I said, if in case. Uh, but I am really uh, impressed with the tranquilla. It has everything. My hands are sticky. If you don't like having sticky hands, don't cook outdoors because it comes with a deal. You know, you get a bit. Yeah. No, we did it the outdoors way. And also, thank you, Victor. Three gaffler. Yes, three. Three. No, three. Wooden. Yes, recyclable. You see, it's counting the time for us. Looks cool. I mean, this is bragging rights. Okay, I feel I have bragging rights now. What? Why? Do I? Don't I have bragging rights? Hey, Nils. Where did my coffee go? Ah, someone drank it. Someone drank my coffee. I know who it is. So yeah, the vampire game. Here, have a discussion. The vampire game, uh, it is actually it's the first time that I'm playing a text-based RPG. I know that they were big in the 90s because IRC, you know, I I knew people were playing those things, but I wasn't into those back then. I was more, you know, an FPS, you know, Half-Life back then. That I am that old and everything. Uh, but now because I really, really like Vampire the Masquerade, and I have played uh, the Bloodlines game, video game, and I'm watching now on uh, World of Darkness, they have the sessions, the RPG, the D&D sessions, and I have played the visual novels that they have released recently, and I want more. So yes, I'm going to play the text-based uh, RPGs, and I am. And they're so, so nice. I mean, if you like... I'm talking... Uh, if they're not stupid, go away, go, go, go away, go away. I'm playing a text-based RPG for the first time. It's 
Nice. Nice. You sit to the left. No, there's no dogs there. No. I'm not talking about what we're doing in the shadows. I'm talking about Vampire the Masquerade. What we're doing in the shadows is a completely different thing. It's Raynal from IT Crowd that makes that show. So yeah, this is what I have been playing recently. So yeah. Uh, not any big... What? It was... It's old. What? I don't hear... I didn't hear you anything now. So it's good that I didn't hear what you said. What I, when I mean old, I mean that, you know, as I said, it was more popular in the late 90s. I'm always late to the party, we know that. You hungry, Nils? Ah, it's a few minutes only, like a couple of minutes left. We're getting there. And this is the mix. Egg and parmesan. Not pecorino, parmesan. Not everyone understands eggs, Swedish. We have to wait until they. If you put the eggs when the pasta is very hot, very hot, yes. It breaks, break, so to speak. Break. What is the correct the word? Creamy is possible, but. No. No more than that. Yes. Yeah, yeah, Den här gafflen vill jag. Jag tar den. In i ett kritiskt ögonblick här. Men jag tror att den snabbar mer. Så. Wow! That looks very good. Delicious. Wow, nice and creamy. And yummy too. Yummy. Yes, thank you. That's enough, that's enough, it's okay. That is a success. That is a success. So, yes. Thank you for watching my experiences in outdoors cooking with Trangia. See you next time. Bye.